In the age of emails and text messages, a lot of kids don't appreciate the art of the old-fashioned letter or understand just how hard the post office works to deliver mail. But as Action 7 News anchor Angela Brower shows us, Inez Elementary's new program is giving students a crash course. One, one, ten. One, ten. Oh, my God. Okay, <laughs> next one. <laughs> it's a meal. Oh, my goodness. Students at Inez Elementary are stepping Whoa. into new roles. They're not just kids anymore. They're kids with jobs. I used to work for the post office, and I thought it'd be a good learning experience. Teacher Brenda Padilla recently set up this mailbox in the school hallway. She encourages kids to write letters. Can we write to a teacher? Can we write to a friend? I was like, you can write to anyone you want. They then mail them off just like they would in real life. Hold it, put it in an envelope. Put your address in there. You have to put a stamp. These three sort the mail and deliver. That one's the one that they didn't address properly, so we're going to return to sender. They say it's a tough job. I'm getting tired. That they have no idea how the real mail people do it day in and day out. Really, really hard. Kids are not only learning about the mail service, but they're also learning responsibility. Also, that a letter still means something. And it's much more personal. Nowadays, everybody's texting and they're putting things abbreviated. Padilla says she plans to keep this going, that they're looking to expand the program throughout their school, maybe even into others. I'm Angela Brower, KYT, Action Hello. 7 News. Thank you. To make it as realistic as possible, Padilla says on the same days the real post office was busy before the holidays, the students were as well. Well, the Lobos have